All right, y'all, one 18 ounce bag of cheese tortellini, all right? Next, I have one pound of cooked Jimmy Dean breakfast sausage. Now, uh, y'all can use Italian sausage if you want instead, but I, don't, I just, I like Jimmy Dean. I think it tastes so good. All right, I have some uh, cut up cherry or grape tomatoes. I don't, I don't know, grape, cherry, one of those, one of those fruits. All right. And then y'all, I also have a, a bag of baby spinach that Bridgie chopped up for me. All right, so we're gonna put that in here too. The whole thing, That's, that looks like a lot of spinach, but y'all know once spinach wilts, it's like nothing, okay? Now y'all, um, we need to put a little season in. So I'm gonna put a little bit of thyme. I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, basil. All right, and then what else am I gonna put in here? Some salt and pepper. Mostly because this is so fun. I love using this thing, it's just so fun. Pepper, let's see, there we go. Pepper, this is so fun, I'm so excited, yay. Oh. All right, next y'all, I have uh, one container of chicken broth, um, four cups, so I'm gonna use the whole thing. Uh, if y'all wanna use vegetable broth, you can, or beef, or whatever kind you want, but I'm using chicken because that's what I have, so that's what I'm using, all right? That's what I'm using. All right, we need uh, to add two more things here. Two more very important things. One of them, garlic. I love garlic. We're using this little scooper thing, this little mini ice cream scooper. That's what it is, right? And then y'all, I have uh, one brick of cream cheese, all right? Um, so what we're gonna do actually before we use our cream cheese is we're gonna give this a little mixy mixy. So uh, this don't really have to cook that long in the crock pot. If y'all want to use frozen pasta, you can, but I got the fresh con, so it don't really have to cook that long. Probably like an hour or two, maybe, I don't know. I'm not sure yet, I'll let y'all know later. Y'all know how I do, but um, that's it. It's very simple, it's an easy, hearty, somewhat somewhat healthy, it's pretty healthy, right? I mean, healthy-ish, right, Bridgie? Yeah, yeah. yeah. healthy-ish. There's some veggies, some pasta, some sausage, and cream cheese, I love cream cheese. So does Bridgie, we love it. We always talk about this. Me and Bridgie <laughs> love cream cheese. So good, all right, so we're gonna put some cream cheese squares all the way around, all right? And we're gonna get, we and, and also y'all, we make it a mess. That's what we're doing. Most important, make a mess. My Fred was helping me with something earlier and it was like, he was making it too perfect. And I was like, Fred, that's not how we do it here in Kristen's kitchen. We make messes and we make things Perfectly imperfect, just like my shirt says. Just like my shirt says, Fred, right? He, he's over here, y'all. He just ain't talking because he knows I'm right. He was he was helping me with something. I'll tell y'all about it later, but he was just making them too perfect. I'm like, y'all, I'm like, Fred, they gonna know that wasn't me because I don't make things perfect. All right, anyways, we're gonna cover this and cook this on a high for like one or two hours. I'm not sure. I'll let y'all know later, but y'all are gonna love this easy dinner. Oh, uh, look, I'm tempting the cats with treats. He smells it. I don't know if he'll be able to eat it out of my hand right now, though. I might have to throw it. You gonna take it, baby? You smelling it? Let's see, is he trying? <laughs> All right, baby, I'll, I'll put you down and I'll throw your treat. Go get your treat, baby, go get it. Run, run, run. All right, there he goes. All right, y'all, so this was the sausage and tortellini uh, with vegetable or chicken stock. I forgot what kind of stock I used. Spinach, tomatoes. Uh, yeah, so simple, easy, kinda healthy soup, or it's, it's not that soupy, but that's okay. We're gonna call it soup. We can call it whatever we want, y'all, but it's gonna be delicious, okay? It's a hearty, I mean, it's not chili. It's just like a hearty, a hearty pasta dish. That's it. It gets creamy with the cream cheese. Creamy with the cream cheese. Yep, that's what I just said. Okay, anyways. This looks great, though, actually. It looks real good. Move, I want the steam to stop. <laughs> it's making me mad. I guess I should have let it cool off first then. My own fault. All right, now, now this is looking, this is looking real good. Bridgie, now that the cream cheese uh, kind of got in, yeah, that looks great. It looks like creamy and delicious. So time to serve some. I'm gonna put some in our bowl. Oh, I have a ladle here. I don't know why I didn't use it, but that's okay. Give me some of these tomatoes. Um, I cooked this on high for about two hours, y'all, so it'll, it should be perfect. All right, Get another little tomato right on top. All right, this is looking so good. Uh, I feel like this might be the winner of the day. I don't know, I haven't tried it yet, but. Y'all, it's gonna be so hot. We have our veggies in here. We have our cheese tortellini, some sausage. Um, so I'm just gonna have a little bite because it's gonna be real hot. I'm over my tongue. Here we go, y'all. Mmm. Okay, y'all. Uh, I was right. The texture, the, the sauce, it, it tastes so good with the cream cheese. It's, it just has a real good flavor with the Jimmy Dean breakfast sausage and the pasta, I mean, yeah, I love this. I think this is so good. Y'all have to try it.